The 10 Things to Do in Rome Welcome to the Eternal City. In this guide, we invite you on a virtual journey to discover the 10 things to do in Rome. Whether you want to explore Rome on a budget or are more interested in visiting unique buildings, these videos will help you discover the city's rich heritage and create memories that will last a lifetime. Rome, the capital of Italy, is a city that exerts an irresistible allure on travelers from around the world, where ancient history, fine art and mouth-watering cuisine converge in a symphony of beauty and charm. From awe-inspiring landmarks to hidden gems, Rome offers many unforgettable experiences. 1. The Colosseum A well-known representation of historic Rome is a spectacular example of the majesty of the Roman Empire. This enormous amphitheater in the middle of the city originally served as the setting for magnificent gladiatorial fights, wild animal hunts, and other public shows. The towering stone walls and rows of arches that make up its spectacular design are examples of the ancient Romans' engineering prowess. Visitors may now stroll through the expansive interior and imagine the roars of the audience as they stand where history was created. Although a guided tour of the arena and underground at night provides for an amazing experience, you can join an express tour if you're in a hurry. 2. The Pantheon a marvel of classical Roman construction is the Pantheon. It serves as evidence of the creativity and grace of its designers. This amazing building served as a temple for the Roman gods more than 2,000 years ago. The magnificent dome is its standout feature, the largest unreinforced concrete dome in the world. It is a perfect hemisphere. Grand columns adorn the exterior of the Pantheon which opens to a splendid interior flooded with sunlight. The well-known oculus in the dome center lets this light pass through. The Pantheon is a magnificent sight to behold due to its elegant fusion of classical design, engineering prowess, and spiritual aura. Free admission is provided, but for a more educational experience, we advise a guided tour. 3. The Roman Forum in the center of Rome, there is a sizable archaeological monument called the Roman Forum. The Forum was once the heart of the Roman Empire and a thriving center for politics. You'll get a sense of time travel as you stroll through the ruins of temples and old structures. The magnificent Palatine Hill and Capitoline Hill backdrop adds to the grandeur of the Forum's ruins. Exploring the Roman Forum is like following in the ancient Romans' footsteps and provides an amazing look into a culture that had a profound impact on the world. 4. Vatican City The Vatican City is the smallest autonomous state in the world and the seat of the Roman Catholic Church's spirituality. It is a treasure mine of art history, and spirituality and is situated in the heart of Rome. Visitors can experience various wonderful attractions inside its revered walls. The largest Catholic church in the world and a masterpiece of architecture, St. Peter's Basilica, serves as the focal point. From the towering dome created by Michelangelo to the exquisite statues and delicate mosaics that adorn its interior, its grandeur is breathtaking. The Vatican Museums, which house a sizable collection of historical and artistic artifacts amassed over centuries by numerous popes, are yet another must-see. Numerous masterpieces, including the well-known Sistine Chapel, can be found in the museums. Astonishing frescoes by Michelangelo, including the well-known creation of Adam, cover the ceiling in this room. 5. Palatine Hill Palatine Hill is a captivating site steeped in ancient history and mythological significance. As the central one of the seven hills of Rome, it is considered the birthplace of the city. Imperial palace ruins, luxurious villas, and historic gardens can all be found here. Visitors can experience the splendor of ancient Rome by strolling through the archaeological park atop Palatine Hill. Investigate the ruins of rich homes from the past and take in their magnificent architecture. Palatine Hill provides an insight into the lavish way of life of the Roman aristocracy. From the fabled hut of Romulus to the imperial palace complex called Domus Augustana. 6. 
Castel Sant'Angelo. This ancient fortification was created by the Emperor Hadrian as a mausoleum for his family and himself. Its use over the years has varied considerably, from fortress to papal residence to jail to museum now. The Passetto di Borgo, a defensive corridor, links Castel Sant'Angelo and Vatican City. Popes used this corridor as a covert exit during dangerous situations. Visitors can now delve into Castel Sant'Angelo's extensive past. One of Castel Sant'Angelo's highlights is the terrace on top of the castle, offering panoramic views of Rome. 7. Piazza Navona Piazza Navona is one of the wonders of Rome and one of the most beautiful squares in the world. Built on the track of the Stadium of Domitian, it is close to Campo de Fiori and the historic Via dei Coronari, an open-air museum, where you can admire the Fontana dei Quattro Fiumi by Bernini, the Fontana del Moro, the Fontana del Natuno, or the Church of San Agnes in Agon by Borromini, a place of culture and nightlife, where you can stroll among canvases by painters and shows by street artists. In the morning, for a coffee or in the evening for an aperitif, the square is always a fantastic meeting point to enjoy delicious drinks with a view, surrounded by the magnificent setting. 8. Trevi Fountain An iconic masterpiece nestled in the heart of Rome, is a mesmerizing blend of Baroque art and ancient mythology. At the intersection of three busy streets, this magnificent fountain is situated. Intricate sculptures and elaborate reliefs surround the great statue of Neptune, the Roman deity of the sea, which serves as the building's focal point. The splendor of Rome's cultural legacy is reflected in the stunning show of water cascading down in a symphony of sound and movement. According to legend, throwing a coin into the fountain guarantees a subsequent trip to the Eternal City. Numerous tourists who are anxious to capture the enchantment and charm of this captivating monument participate in this custom. 9. Altar della Patria In the center of Rome, there is a grand building called the Altar della Patria. Other names for it include the Altar of the Fatherland, the National Monument to Vittorio Emanuele II, and Wedding Cake among locals. This imposing structure made of white marble serves as a reminder of Italian unification. With massive colonnades, sweeping stairs, and an equestrian statue in the center, it has a neoclassical design. The Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, a solemn memorial honoring fallen troops, is located inside the monument. A glass lift takes visitors to the panoramic terraces, where they can rise and take in breathtaking views of Rome's skyline. 10. Capitoline Museum The first museum in the history of museums. This is the ideal location to learn more about Rome's past. The famed she-wolf sculpture depicting Rome's founders Romulus and Remus, Medusa by Bernini, and a fountain in the style of a horn-shaped drinking cup are a few of the more notable items in its collection. You can expect a fantastic view of the Roman Forum when you're there because the museum gets its name from the hill that it is located on. Since the Vittorio Emmanuel II monument and the Capitoline Museum are just adjacent to each other, you can visit both places at once. Are you ready and eager to explore Rome? Plan your visit as best you can and discover the beauty of Italy. And if you have other places to suggest, write it in the comments. Enjoy your trip to the Eternal City.